हेलो डियर फ्रेंड्स टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू लर्न हाउ टू मेक गुलाब जामुन विद वेरी सिंपल इंग्रेडिएंट्स डेट आर इजीली अवेलेबल इन आर किचन वन बोल ऑफ सूजी टू बोल्स ऑफ शुगर आर सूजी शुड बी फाइन इफ योर सूजी इज नॉट फाइन जस्ट ग्राइंड इट इन अ मिक्सर एंड योर यू विल गेट अ परफेक्ट सूजी एंड वी विल नीड हाफ लीटर ऑफ फुल क्रीम मिल्क फॉर दिस नाउ वी वी आर गोइंग टू एड sugar in a pan one bowl now we'll take another bowl and put it in the pan now we will add one bowl of water two bowls of sugar and one bowl of water our flame should be medium low to medium we will stir it and our sugar sugar syrup sugar syrup will be ready now next step take a pan and grease it with ghee like this you have to grease it now we will pour milk half liter full cream milk in a pan you can take boiled milk or you can boil it now if your milk is boiled you can add it sugar after putting it into the pan now give it a mix now we will add our suji in it our milk is hot and now we will add add suji in batches otherwise there will be lumps in batches you have to add and stir it continuously now you can see our dough is going to be ready stir it continuously agar otherwise it will stick into the kadai now our dough is ready we will turn on the, turn off the flame and now check our now we will check our sugar syrup it should be greasy there should not be any tar just feel it on your finger keep it on your fingers and feel it if it will if it is greasy then it is fine and ready now you can turn off the gas now i have transferred that dough in a plate we will let it be cool so that we can rub it through our palms and we have to give it a perfect mix so that it text its its texture will be fine i have i am putting 3 tablespoon of ghee now we will rub it with our palms like this you have to make your dough see the texture it's not looking like that that we have used suji it is very soft and you have to give it a perfect mix so that your gulab jamun will be in perfect shape rub it you have to rub it again and again see it's taking shape now now it's ready it's going to be ready now we will see its texture you have to do it very carefully and it will take time now you can touch it it is very soft and you can see the texture of this now take the dough between your palms and we will make a ball you can change the size according to your need and they should make a ball very proper so that there should not be any crack and uh, one bowl of with the help of one bowl of suji we can make 35 to 38 gulab jamuns 
इट्स डिपेंड ऑन योर साइज टेक अप ऑयल इन अ पैन लेट इट बी हॉट वैन यू आर गोइंग टू पुट योर गुलाब जामुन इन द पैन फ्लेम शुड बी लो अदरवाइज इट विल गेट बर्न give it time and after 3 to 4 minutes you can stir it there is no need to be in hurry they take time now you can see they are there is no crack while frying and now we can stir it and we can check so that every part should get a proper flame and see you can check it now the golden color is coming we are going to fry see they are in perfect shape you have to wait it as it will take time now i have fried all the gulab jamuns what we are going to do next we will put our gulab jamun in a hot sugar syrup pour it and give it a mix and we will leave the gulab jamuns in a sugar syrup for 15 to 20 minutes so let they will absorb the sugar syrup now you can see after 15 to 20 minutes you can check the texture i have transferred the gulab jamun in a pan it's very hot i am not able to hold it but see you it's a perfect texture